Have you ever wondered what really happens when a fly lands on your food? Flies, those buzzing aerial acrobats, are far more than just annoying pests. They're incredible insects with a crucial role in ecosystems, from pollination to decomposition. Flies are nature's cleanup crew. They are key players in the decomposition process, breaking down organic matter like dead animals, plant material, and other debris. Certain fly species, such as blowflies and flesh flies, lay their eggs on decomposing matter. A fly lands on your sandwich. What's the first thing it does? Well, it starts spitting. Yes, you heard that right. Within a matter of seconds after landing, a fly can initiate its feeding process, which involves the regurgitation of digestive fluids onto your food to pre-digest it. Now that your sandwich is practically liquid gold, the fly uses its sponge-like mouthparts to slurp up the nutritious juices. This unique feeding process allows them to extract nutrients without the need for chewing. You have probably noticed that flies appear to rub their front legs together after landing on your food. Why is that? This behavior is essentially how a fly cleans or grooms its front legs. Flies use their legs to explore their environment, gather information about their surroundings, and locate sources of food. A fly's legs also play a role in their feeding process. Grooming helps clean their legs after feeding and prevents any residual digestive fluids from interfering with their ability to fly or sense their environment. Here's where it gets really unsettling. As we have already discussed, flies aren't exactly the cleanest creatures. So, when a fly lands on your food, it can bring along a whole party of bacteria, pathogens, and even allergens. These microorganisms can include harmful bacteria like E. coli, salmonella, and others which have the potential to make you sick. Now, before you swear off picnics forever, not every fly spells doom. But the potential for contamination is real. Ingesting these unwelcome hitchhikers can lead to stomach upset, food poisoning, or worse. Infants, the elderly, and those with weakened immune systems are particularly vulnerable. So it's not just about a ruined meal, it's about your health too.